rise and fall We've seen it all But something goes much deeper Who we really are What the finds us are Know that there is no weakness Still I wait to change and fall Become the one I am The journey has begun right now Born from ashes I will go Caught in a change We will transform Bangersong. Hello, hello. What's up, egg? What's up, dude? What's up, on negative? Thanks for the good lucks. Yeah. Let's see. Why did I. I fat fingered that. Awesome. Also, picked up the wrong window again. Let me fix that right away, because I hate it when that happens. Just pick up the correct window, please. Wait, where even is the correct window? Huh? There is no correct window? Okay, whatever. Okay. <coughs> Yo, coffee cat, hello. What's up, what's up? And Hacky as well. How are you guys doing? Did some fair golden progress today. Sing it up, Power Source, and remember the Deathless and EH in two decks. Nice, nice. Let's go. GG Farewell Golden Progress. HL on our many Fs is CG. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, uh, so since yesterday was absolutely dog shit, terms of runs, I will do uh, RC till end as usual, one time. After that I will play all the hard rooms once as usual, and after that I will do Dark Arm death Deathless, because that was absolutely horrible yesterday. And only when I have done that I will Spam attempts again. Because, oh my god, I need to stop dying to that stupid room. Uh, not that stupid room, that stupid checkpoint. What do we do H Deathless tomorrow if I have time? Still don't know how to do 
ST2 Yes. So don't know how to do ST2 consistently. Um, learn the slow fall strat. Do yourself a favor and do the slow fall strat. It should be somewhere on on uh, Clord hashtag deathless strats. <coughs> so I died on MTE final room in two consecutive runs. What? That's a thing. That is very, very unfortunate. So you basically almost did MTE X2. Yeah, <laughs> holy crap. We do be getting this today. <laughs> I I don't know. No fucking idea. This golden is a fucking mystery box. I can absolutely not judge how long this will take. Cause small mistakes amplify a lot when the map is this long. Real you run for freedom for Clegolden. Good luck, Viddy. <laughs> what? It was stop? Or was that actually over? I don't know. But yes, small mistakes cost a lot of time in this golden. Like I did yesterday, I died three times to three absolutely ridiculous ways in the Dark Arm checkpoint, which meant I wasted about three hours yesterday. Wow, that was horrible. What's up, what's up? Thanks, good luck. I'm a bit afraid of that Jellivate, because you get quite low doing that. In general, this no one section is so scary.
video. Uh, I'll delay that as usual until I'm done practicing all the difficult rooms once. Okay, that was basically one stupid death in uh, in RC, and that's it. That's good. Let me open the video already, so they don't forget. Okay, so last two rooms of this. No, I keep forgetting. I need to do this cutscene thing now. Teleport. So I died here, which is so dumb. So I usually wouldn't see myself, but I don't think it matters that much here. Yo, QZ. What's up, what's up? Trying to figure out where I need to go here. Okay, I guess that's good for it. Yeah, that. Just don't release crap up there. I still don't know how I managed to fuck that up two days ago. Rage for good runs, so true. Oh, I make. Thanks for the good luck. I've been playing through some banger maps today. E oh yeah, I, I saw that you were live, but I sadly did not have any time to watch streams today. So that's that's cool. Hopefully you're enjoying your break from work. No cutscene here. Actually, it might be better to just wait one out immediately. Yes. Yeah, like that. All right. Be super nice hopefully got time to actually play something now yo let's go i'm gonna do water bear mountain soon awesome uh, great map enjoy that one oh oops there's not a cutscene that we need to skip Farewell Golden 3, you're gonna beat it first attempt. Oh my god, you beat it. What the fuck? Fastest Farewell Golden ever. Okay. Play this room three times. I don't want to die here again. Well, 
well, that was dumb. Also, I did- wait, I did not play my spec character, I just noticed what the fuck. Okay. Okay, thank you. Beat Pharaoh Gold on a book. What the fuck? Nine again, WTA? Wait, what? Okay, like this strat is foolproof, right? There is no way that I die here again. I just slide, reverse, grab, jump over, wounds. There is no way that I die here. Why is it 9? Oh, the request. Uh, because Q was not going down. <laughs> People kept requesting stuff. Wait. Huh? I cannot pick up the berry. Um. <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, did I fuck something up? No, I did. Did I? I did some programming stuff today, and I might have fucked this up. Maybe safe state? The safe state should not fuck that up. Should definitely not happen, just because of safe states. <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> I think I fucked that up myself. Um, so, interesting thing, Parrot had an issue with uh, Consistency Tracker yesterday, which was that uh, when he was grinding for the berries in 9BB, it was lagging his game. And that, I, I, I've, I've determined that that issue was probably because when you are on a berry, like, not, no matter if you've picked it up or if you're just picking it up, uh, an event will be called that you are on the berry. And uh, I apparently did not have a protection against it that uh, uh, when you're like on it a lot, it would generate a bunch of lock messages, which is, which might lag your game, and uh, yeah, I fixed that today, which meant that uh, only one of these events is uh, 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 done for every berry, and it's reset once you die, or uh, once you like uh, pick up the berry, right? I didn't die and I didn't pick up the berry because I restored the safe state. So uh, apparently my mod is disallowing the pickup of that berry. So I'm guessing if I die right now and play this room again, it should work. If that's the case, then uh, that was actually my mod's fault. Good, I need to write that down. <laughs> uh, fuck. Save states. Alright, good. Awesome. Very interesting. So, so much for that. ST now. Me when Kaufland. Also, ah, color grade. Oh yeah, also there is a lot in the queue, so let me switch to song requests now, right away. Uh, where's my thingy here?
We start off with aviators. Awesome. Yo, Aurora. How are you doing? Thanks for the good luck. How is it raining in space? <laughs> True. Yeah, okay, this room is so free. I still have not died to the new strat. So it's awesome. But it is here on today, my second ever. Sadly, it died in ST1? How do you die to ST1? Huh? Okay, it's still fine. What did it bounce on the spring twice for some reason? It died because it disappeared. You can bounce on it twice with specific specific setup I often do. But I didn't do that. Ah! Oh my god, that is that is a death. Yo, Flamel, what's up? What's up? And hello, Pain as well. Oh, that is so unfortunate. But hey, I guess you are the first person I know that has died to ST1. Never seen anyone else die to that. <laughs> Frank. What if that isn't her? <laughs> What's up, Spicky? Nitro also died to ST1. That is unlucky. Wait, Mario also died ST1? Seriously? Okay, I must have missed that. What? VDO? VD, can you VDO? The cat VDO. VDO, 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 VDO. What, 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 what video? Oh, yeah, I said I will do that after practice. Like, did you not listen, Flamo? Ah! <laughs> I delayed the video until i have done practicing. Just before I start runs, I will do that. <laughs> that fucking evil. <laughs> Troll insane. Yes. Okay, so stuff that I want to practice is now actually almost done. Uh, only one thing left, which is to uh, Dark RM Deathless ones. <laughs> no, Pain, the name is not that in this chat. It's IRL Catting in this chat. Three Paul, but Frank. Yep, that's so good. Uploaded to the send cat. you as well. So the cat. Fit. The cat it is trolling. Help. The cat. The cat. Him in crystal. The cat. Him like Theo. Him stuck in this crystal. Forever. I can't breathe. The cat. Monka is poor Theo?
Frank but Frank. Frank but Frank. <laughs> so true. Okay, let's not do that uplift. Calypta FCG still tier 2. Good question, good question. So I did Dark Arm first, the Deathless first try, so can I like please do this in runs? Thank you. The first chapter in its B-side in the sleep mod pack today, one step closer to a sleep, max percent Deathless. Yes, let's go. Okay, I also want like some strat for this beginning part, because this is very... It's so stupid how I died here yesterday, I still can't believe that. That works, I guess. Anything better? Nah. Anything wrong with this strat? What if I go early? But actually I can also like turn around and dash. Okay. What if I go early? Like it doesn't matter. Okay, I can't go that early. Should be free though, right? So I hope the other chapters B sides are normal chapter, not just A side but more spiky. Uh, I have no idea, I have not played the first two chapters of the sleep so I cannot tell you anything about that. Also, uh, uh, Run for Freedom doesn't have a B side. It has a cassette type but no B side. Whoa, what the fuck? Yo, Toto, what's up, what's up? How are you doing? Okay, so good new setup. Don't do that though, interesting. Wait, actually if you hold down you die or what? <laughs> Wait, you slide further if you hold down? You slide further if you hold down. I didn't even know that. Can okay, I get here if I don't hold down? Oh my god, what? That's so interesting. Apparently friction is lower when you crouch. Okay, cool. Don't hold anything there. Should be free, right? Cool. <coughs> Setups are plaguing the deathless community. People used to just YOLO every jump. Yes! True, true, true. Okay, uh... Let me pause this and pull up video real quick. Uh, played space runes today and got absolutely destroyed by the final room of CP4. Uh, yep. 
That one is notorious for being uh, one of the hardest in the entire chapter. Uh, for some people, even the hardest room. That is the wrong window. Can I like select the other one? Thank you. Awesome. So, how to change? Is there like audio? Put the volume thingy on the middle. There will be volume later, it won't be loud. Okay, so medium volume is like this for me. What the fuck? Get a keybind for only downright dash. Might be useful, but yeah. Why are we watching Ellen tutorial? <laughs> Cause play more redeemed it. But so what the fuck is the how to change? What what are we changing? There is music. <laughs> Does anyone know about the Ellen tutorial arc? ARG? No, I don't. <laughs> Fucking love this channel. Yeah, you. Flamo does as well. <laughs> okay, uh, yes, sure. I'm not sure what we changed, but apparently we changed something. <laughs> the fuck? My <laughs> laptop when I opened Celeste. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Very interesting. <laughs> what was that? I have no idea. <laughs> hey, oh, hello, Nave. Thanks for good luck of fun. Watch a Night Minds Explained video on this channel. Genuinely a great art project. <laughs> what the fuck? If you provide me with a link, I, I might watch it. I might. Can't watch it here, although it's an hour long. Yeah, I, I will watch it off stream. Oh, it, if it's an hour long, I don't know. I can't promise. I don't have that much time, usually. What was coming for songs again? Uh, to request songs? Exclamation mark SR. Get this golden today for IRL time save. True.
Didn't even know these sites had golds in prologue and epilogue. Yeah, they do have them, I guess. I never got them, but <laughs> whatever. Jump scares are the weakest form of scary videos. So true. Atmosphere is important. Horror that can make me feel dread without jump scaring me is the best type of horror. 100% this <laughs> 7.5% through Naruto now finally got to a hard 300 ish episodes until he died I don't know if that is like a serious spoiler or anything I have never watched Naruto so I don't know and I'm also never gonna watch it so I also don't care but uh, I hope you didn't ruin it for anyone else right now yo toho what's up Thanks, good luck of fun. to any horror but jump scare. <laughs> Super weak to horror. Most minor jump scares jump scares that don't even qualify as jump scares scare me. <laughs> oh god. You to do things. Good luck for fun, RFF. Yo. Good luck, things, dude. Thanks for good luck of fun. get the V hug idea. Uh, I mean like a million other channels already have it and someone did the channel point uh, suggestion redeem thingy suggesting that uh, so I added it. <laughs> Why not? The thing you do in bubble is literally the IRL catting emote. <laughs> so true.
so true. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Sienna? And uh, also, by chat, speaking running 71 years. What? Oh. See you in a bit. Welcome back, chat. Wow. Just wow. How do you miss that reef? Gate skip in Feral Gold, let's go. Base. Make the dice an extra joke when you're close chat and even you, you never die. Because I wasn't fast enough this time. Uh. <laughs> what would you do if you got SPFCG except you missed a berry? Well, I didn't get SPFCG then. I got SPG. So uh, I would redo it. Missing a berry is absolutely non-negotiable. If it was something stupid like you accidentally save state in the middle, which means the berry turns grey, I would probably consider still consider that like a legit achievement for myself. I don't care what anyone else would say about that. I don't even know how that is handled by Molden team. But missing a berry, that is, that's an easy case, that is not an FC one. Real video wouldn't even think of SPFCG, is so true, fuck that. I will never touch that, I'd rather do DMR full golden than SPFCG. How do you have the will to do long goldens? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I just have. I just wanted to do one. This will also probably... Actually, not, I, I don't mind long goldens. If the gameplay is enticing. Which is like, the first three checkpoints of this map are really not that interesting of gameplay. Which makes it a bit stale after a while. If the gameplay was still interesting and hard, that would still be cool. I would absolutely not mind spending way longer than I am right now on this map as well. It's the same shit as with uh, Space Ruins, right? I died eight fucking times to final room in space rooms, but I. It, it was not that terrible because the map was still fun to play, <laughs> even after like 56 hours of playing it. You can't do more than five runs. <laughs> But I guess that depends on how far you get. I'm usually doing 
around 10 to 15 runs per session. Enjoy me. Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> need someone better to get it. I can't do it. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know if I will ever go for the full gold, but the second silver is very interesting to me. It doesn't matter, I just can't go and play farewell for more than 10 minutes. Yeah, that that's a map issue, IMO. If the map is just not that fun to play, like to grind for you, that happens. But if it's a fun map, I could play that for hours. I bet I can get 50 runs a session, none of which into power source. Yep, yeah, that happens. The worse the attempts in the session, the more attempts you will have in the session. FCP6 soon, real FC run soon TM, let's go. Bad news, the first room of CP5 is a literal gamble. Oh god. <laughs> that does not sound fun. But honestly I would be up for a another uh, get good golden. What's up? Are you for real? Are you like on God? <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean? Kebab to tweak it. Let's go. Garfield, are you for real or on guard? Oh, what? What the fuck are you talking about? This music makes me very uneasy. <laughs> uh, let me just skip this. That is too creepy for me right now. <laughs> I'm on my last two brain cells. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, I'm a close chat now since I'm coming up on session PB.
fuck that was. Close. for once.
I forgot again where to dash. How do I keep memory issuing this room? I don't understand it. I had that exact death already, like a few days ago. Where I just forget where to dash. Dash right, up, upright. What's so hard about remembering that? My god. I literally can't do this room again. How often did I die to this room now? Six times! And not a single death in this room was good. Dude, that's so dumb. Ugh. Yo, hello Mario. What's up, what's up? He for gore, yep. Yeah. I just don't know what the fuck is happening when I'm in a real run in that checkpoint anymore. I did practice, when I did practice before runs today, I went into that chapter and did a deathless first try. It's not hard, I just can't do it in runs apparently. Literal tier 0 golden creeps just got tier 0 without knowing it. So true. Oh, yo, hello Jess. Mario says hi too. <laughs> hello Mario as well. Hope you two are having fun at meetup. This is run for freedom. It's actually tier zero. No, it's not. I should have gotten this golden already, like, I don't know, 20 hours ago or so. Okay, not 20, maybe like 15 or so. I already had have two RC deaths. And how many melancholy deaths? Is it three now? Wait, let me let me look. Uh no, two. Two melancholy deaths and Two RC deaths. Uh, I should have gotten this already, but I didn't. So whatever. Literally watching you on his PC. Let's go. <laughs> what is it? Tier zero golden. I don't think I've heard of that. Uh, no, 90G is not a tier zero. 90G is tier. I don't know, minus one or minus two if you go into that direction. Tier 0 is more Waterbury Mountain Golden or Folklear Golden and uh, Old 71B Golden. Which is the shit that Nils is currently grinding for. Old 71B. That. And uh, Clantis and Benny going for Waterbury Mountain Golden. Nine DG is still way harder than anything of that. Did creeps contribute seventy one D attempts? Uh, I have no idea actually. That was before my time in this community. I have no idea what creeps or what anyone for that matter bit for old 71D. I got 71 DG before he played Celeste. <laughs> Surely.
you got numb, but still. What was that? Deathless Pace Ping? Mac Panda? <laughs> Mac is pinging for himself! <laughs> oh, what? Wait, what? <laughs> that is so funny. I don't know why. <laughs> it's such a Mac thing, it's so true. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Remember I said I had a secret project after 6DG? It was new 71DG grind, oh my god. I actually have no idea how far that is into the map. Wasn't Spiky's run like 23 or 24 minutes or something? Let me, let me check. Uh... Yeah. 22 minutes actually only. Oh, so that is quite late. Oh, Jesus Christ. Second last checkpoint, yeah. I looked at FCG as a thing. What tier? Uh, high tier 2, as judged by Specky. But people are like not sure how precise that is. <laughs> oh. That was so scary, I don't know why. I guess Mac can maybe confirm placement now when, 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 when he gets it. Probably tier 1 IMO. From what I've played, I would also have said that. But Spiky just didn't confirm that. Like this gameplay. What? The fuck? what? Oh, there was not extent. Uh. Damn. I didn't get my dodge back. That's unlucky. That that's very unlucky. Yeah, from what I've played of this map, uh, I have no clue why that didn't extend. it didn't feel that much easier or harder than 70. And, uh, yeah, it's about the same length, so so I would also assume it would be, like, low tier 1. <laughs> Jojo. Jojo would fucking curse again. Ah. <laughs> Thought you were watching video? No. That was muck playing. But that is very unfortunate. Judging by the timer, I would have said it's like very fucking close to the end.
And some funny stuff too. Myuk actually is strong mental AF. Yep. Also, Muck is like actually fucking cracked. At Celeste. At Goldens. Listening to new music never heard before all day today. <laughs> what the fuck? Let's go.
Uh, missing a four frame. I love missing a four frame. <coughs> hey, Willy, you know that Jump King segment at the end of a delusional spire? Uh, it's required to get the heart. I'm not sure. Delusional spire? Do I remember that? The same, yeah, same room as yesterday's death, as one death yesterday, let's say, like that. It's an ancient map by Lenny God. Okay, yeah, then I don't remember it. I've never played that, neither seen that. Yo, oh, hello Simon, and hello Kurtz as well. So yeah, I'm not too mad about the death, because that's like the, the, the tightest part in all of Event Horizon, so whatever. It's fine to die to that once in a while. Cat's in a blanket. There's a massive segment where if you mess one thing up, it sends you all the way Vinny back just down most of the your friendly neighborhood yeah, friend Jess here to give love and support for the Golden Run Lily. <laughs> Thank you very much, Jess. It's badly needed by this point. It's like three rooms, the height of RFF final room in a row, and retry sends you back to the first room. What the fuck? That's interesting. Of oh, farewell, farewell, final room, alright. It's like it's just seven golden, what the fuck? So that's some, uh, uh, 9D last room checkpoint, not checkpoint, last room shit, right? Very interesting. <laughs> Did not know that that was a thing. Thank you very much. I need it. Apparently. Half of the session is already almost over and I have not gotten to ST yet. The most inter interesting thing about that segment is how in the second room it changes your physics to jumping physics. 
essentially no air friction. Huh. Three times a jump height. That's very interesting. <laughs> again.
Penso. <laughs> yes, so true. I die due to being one frame late on the four frame, and the very next run I die to being one frame early on the same four frame window. Dude, what the fuck? It's fucking four frames. How am I missing that twice? That sucks to die to that constantly, because every run getting there should be a Dark Arden run. But then, then again, does it matter if I die stupidly to EH or to Dark Arden? I don't think so. So, whatever, I guess. Also just wanna say life data banger. Oh have you tried it out? Is it working for you? Because I I didn't have the confirmation from anyone else that's act that it's actually working. <laughs> so that would be awesome. Is it on stream today? Let's go. Also made your own one, let's go. Yeah, I hope the explanations and stuff uh, were fine. Because I really didn't want to make another like tutorial video or some shit like that. But that's so much effort. Uh, so much cleaner to have that just in code. Oh fuck, I fucked up my cipher.
That shit doesn't matter since that shit moves so slowly. Okay. This is very quiet. Must be copied from three, so yeah, fine. That's what they are for. But it works, so that's awesome. Did some testing and also my top 5 run has a CP5 now. <laughs> yes. Actually, let me see what version I am on right now. Am I on my dev version? I am on my dev version right now, but uh, here I added this, remove golden berry devs from the room. So, uh, that's gonna be in a next update. Ah, that's, that's sometime, I don't fucking know. Does it get updated after I fixed my data file? <laughs> uh, wait, what? What do you mean? Oops, that's not what you do. Now this is loud. Fuck. Oh, you mean, oh, uh, does the, the live data thing get updated when you fix the file? Uh, I don't... Like, if you have the game open the entire time, then I don't think so. Yeah, like, you would need to either... Uh, I think you would need to re... Like, re-enter the chapter, I think it is. Fix it to a bunch of zeros. <laughs> Alright. I mean, only the first two numbers are actually for the Goldenberry devs. The others are for the, uh, like, room consistency. And also, like, you can edit the values if you want, but they are not, like, loaded into the program ever. They are just for display on the overlay. They're actually uh, calculated out of the uh, true and false list at the very end, which is the the list of attempts in the room. Oh, please. Confused stare. I can explain very quickly uh, for example you have this year so that's uh, the stats file and uh, only these first two numbers are for the uh, like this is the golden devs total in the room and this is golden devs in the current session in the room. These numbers are only uh, chances calculated based on this true and false list. So if you change these, uh, that doesn't really matter. It will be overwritten once uh, the, the stats are saved again by the mod. If you want to change like the attempts, you would have to change this true and false list. But I, I, you probably don't want to do that manually. Just do that over the map. And if you want to change like the, the death counter, that would be this one here. My correct scene again? Yes.
enough death records for CP3+, plus, so I turned on only track golden lives. Alright, yeah, so that should have been empty either way, right? And, uh, yeah, the chances are then also just zero, zero, zero everywhere. Alright. Oops. Again, Last possible frame.
I forgot to practice that one room, the new strat from yesterday. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, let's try to remember. Uh, what was the strat again for the next room? Uh, super as usual. Grab immediately wounds over to the left. Jump as fast as possible and dash right. Okay.
I'm mad. I am so mad. Bro, what the fuck was that? You can't transition back? You can't transition back? Dude! Why can you not reset this room? I did not know. Oh my god. Like, my first generate thingy was so low that I was just like, okay, whatever, let's just reset the room. But you can't! When does Jelly not respawn? Jellies don't usually respawn when they die. When they respawn, that's like some 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 map shenanigans that the creator put in explicitly. <sighs> Hate maps like that, that's awful. Map creators that do this are like really annoying for zero reason. Yep. That's so stupid. Yeah, let's just waste 30 minutes and die to this. What? <laughs> Incredible. Good death. That's so dumb. I honestly did not know that. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, that is a death. This is surely not a run that it should have gone to RC. I have now died more in the silhouette checkpoint than in RC. Like, how? The silhouette checkpoint is fucking free. I keep dying to random stuff. Like, not gelevating high enough. The first death here. Or randomly releasing grab for no reason. Also amazing. God. Should do stuff like that only in final room? Yeah, and on, on like checkpoint transitions. On checkpoint transitions it's also fine, but for that no that's that just ah uh. Yeah, so I died two days ago on this bit because I randomly released grab for some reason. One of the deaths of all time, yep. Dude, the death compilation for this golden will be so long. Fucking hell. I have something to show you video. Uh, let me finish this run. Actually not finish this run, but go on until I die one more time. Seems like such an unfun experience. It is slowly becoming that, yes. That would have been an RC run. Yes, so true. Oh, there's no cuts in here. I need to remember that, please. I swear to god, my late deaths in this map are so ridiculous. Thanks for the cat hugs. 
for the cat thorns. Should probably leave again as to not jinx your next run, but first make this dumb tier list. Yeah, I'll I'll do that after after I finish this run. No, it's not a reverse. that you need to go like ever so slightly late into that cycle. Frank, oh my god, we need a Frank hug. Deathless RC, awesome. Don't do that. Remember, do not do that. Give me like some space, thank you. Do not back boost off the platform. Important, remember that. Not like this. Seems to be like it though. Chances are really low that I will ever die to this bit, like to the upwind bit. Because the upwind bit is really easy. The no wind part at the start is actually a bit hard of, of this room. But the upwind portion is free, absolutely free.
Okay, one room to go. And another one there. Let's go. Oh. So, video plus tier list. Okay, let's see here. I'm just that good number six. Oh god, no. <laughs> What the fuck? Yes! <laughs> Cutscene. Nice. So, you... Corner boost, ultra, and another down right. So, when cutscene starts, you fall off here. <laughs> what the fuck? That is very interesting. <laughs> nice. Oh my god. Another one and another one. Okay, we add two of this. And then you're just dead. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> okay, uh, what two of these do we want? We already have the kicker and the dodger. Alright, bedtime. Good night, Flynn. Bye bye. The climber is good, Imo. The Fogor. <laughs> mm. And the climber. Alright, we'll have the climber. Okay, that's one. Now one more. I'm at the shitter or the skater fan. Oh yeah, the skater is awesome. Where's the shitter? Oh here. It's okay. I would I would take the skater. Okay, let's take the skater. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> More cat gift collection. Uh <laughs> What the fuck is this tier list? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Be saving up once we'll get more. Actually, that's awesome, because uh, 7TV recently increased the slot limit. We now have 300 available slots, not 250. So we have a lot more space to go. So, go at it. Okay, so I've played a total of, like, three sessions of uh, Among Us. Um... Yeah, alright, so... What's that? Here's the gift. Here's the twist. What the f- <laughs> Nice. Perfect landing. Okay, I guess I just- How the fuck do I rank this? I like blue. Color blue is good. I like the color red as well. It's such a cat moment, true. Black. Black is very neutral color, like neutral colors, white as well. Mm. Pink is awesome. Mm. 
Mm, not particularly a fan of yellow. Brown as well, it's like a turd. Oh. Cyan? Alright. Yeah, here. Light green? Good. Dark green, eh? Orange? It's also decent. Purple, also decent. Okay. Interesting tier list, yes. <laughs> cool. Uh, not Mark Panda. Not even a D tier? Yeah, there's no D tier color. I mean, okay, you know what? No, whatever. Brown, brown is D tier. Uh, where to this? A very interesting tier list. <laughs> Channel points well spent. <laughs> so true. Also, go back to this. Right. Cool. Just one shot. Maybe. But here's the baller. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I know, I know this game. Brown is D tier. Vidius races. Let's cancel it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> absolutely. <clears throat> nah, brown is just it looks like a turd. Why would you pick brown if you can pick like anything else? Don't know if I should add it. I added three other emotes though. Let's go. Cat gift collection growing. Frank. Okay, I'm I'm happy though with today getting to silhouette checkpoint is awesome. That is a goal for every single day. If I can, like, just stop stupidly dying in that checkpoint. Does Frank Redeem do anything? No. Just a very decent chance that I will say Frank out loud. If there's nothing else happening at the time. Frank. You become Frank, true. Rank. Amazing use of points, true. <laughs> From up. I knew how to add the white bars above the gifts, there would be so many gifts. <laughs> Yeah, I have no idea how to do that myself. There's probably some website that lets you do that. But watermark though, I, I don't know. Frank Enthusiast. Absolutely. We love Frank here. And Terry as well.
made it up with only the gel of it. It's the first time. Same difficulty tier, which kind of golem do you prefer? Longer but easier ones or harder but shorter ones? Uh, from my experience with this so far, definitely harder and shorter ones. I've done a lot of those already and I never had like any problem with them. Even if I got unlucky, it was still fun. And this golem is like uh, starting to annoy me a bit. Because as opposed to the short and hard ones, where you probably have interesting gameplay even at the very beginning, this map is more like snooze fest for about 8 minutes until it starts to become interesting. So yeah, definitely short and hard ones. But actually... I would also not mind long and hard maps, uh, just that those are very rare and uh, like very fucking hard as well. Cat snug, also cat snug blanket. So true.
bang or something, but don't want to risk anything. Where did my dash go? I don't know. Dash just decided to not show up today. Apparently, I did not move far enough left from the block. Somehow, that's the first time that has ever happened. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Chase the unlucky. <sighs> okay. Last run that gets to uh, remembered. Oh, I got the ultra. Maybe at end of stream? Yeah, sure. So yeah, I will do one more run that gets to RM. So... If... This... If this is the last run of the day, then it will take anywhere between... Uh, 6 and uh, 30 more minutes. Great map. I've been pretty bored of repeating the start of MTE, and this is like two and a half times longer. Yeah, uh, this is a very interesting challenge. Like, I usually don't mind it that it's that long. If I do have good runs every day, right? Because that's like a sign of consistency that things are improving. But yesterday was just so bad that I was very... Ah, uh, not very good. Board of Celeste. Oh, dang. I mean, take a break. Don't have to play Celeste all the time. You don't want to.
I didn't extend again. <coughs> Clearly you should do RFF with Theo. So true. There's probably a bunch of rooms that are uh, like not possible at all. Because red bubbles, red bubbles in EH. And also power source actually. It's weird, but I won't play Theo. Ah, the fuck was that? I, I swear I pressed the the jump button, but that just did not work. I, I did not demo. <laughs> Oh, wait, you mean first time it happens, or what? I thought like 1T, wait, is that like a new map? Are there Theo sites now? 1T? Bro. Okay, it's getting quite late. I'll reduce my requirement for the last run to uh, power source. So the next run getting to power source will be the last run. One Theo side. <laughs> Okay, last one of the day.
Bro. Okay, whatever. It's not meant to be. That was horrible. Okay, so absolute shit runs again, except for that those two runs that got far. So that's F decent, I guess. What? There's no cassette music. Why is there no... I don't want to play that one room again. I don't know how that happened. Like, how the fuck did I fuck up this room? Okay, whatever. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Okay, uh, something, are you here for chess game? Because uh, I would be ready now. Okay. Uh, let's go. I mean, today was at least better than yesterday, which I am very happy about. If I can keep up the consistency from today, I still don't think it will take me that much longer. Because getting one run daily past Baddy would be very, very good then I don't think it would take me longer than like a week from now. So that's... that would be good. So I'm definitely happy. Let's go, let's go. I'm getting nicely out of the opening. What? Impossible. Oh! <laughs> I missed this entirely. Wait! <laughs> I just noticed. What the fuck? That was pinned. I thought you could just protect. <laughs> I, got I thought you could literally just move it in front. But no, it was pinned. Oh my god, that was... <laughs> that was a quick game. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, that was... Holy shit. Incredible. I... Not only did I not lose in the opening, but I won in the opening. That is incredible. Okay. <laughs> Quick game, I guess. I never had that.
Queenside Castle into Royal Skewer. <laughs> awesome. Alright. Good. Uh, yeah, so that's it for today, I guess. <coughs> Certainly am better than yesterday. But still far from over, I guess. Actually, no, I just need one run that does not die stupidly anywhere. That should not be hard. <laughs> Good night, have nice sleep. Yes, uh, I will just be raiding Parrot real quick and then go offline as well. Alright, though. No, uh, English! So, thanks for watching, my god. I will be back tomorrow with more RFFC. RFFFC. I keep forgetting an F in there. And uh, goodbye. Have a good night, everyone. But like the, int I just kept dying to antenna too much. But now I realize that.